Disclaimer alert. You are about to watch an extremely epic and bloody movie. Some of the action scenes may be too intense for the nimble-minded viewers out there. Prepare for legitness and be ready to go through a roller coaster of emotions while watching this movie. Hello? Yes, yes, we are on the brink of curing cancer. Yes, I am out on hike, taking break from all the research. Dude, you're gonna be a star for curing cancer. I know we're gonna do it. I know we can, this won't fit. Anyway, I know we can do this, man. We're gonna cure cancer. I know we can do it. Anyway, <clears throat> as I was saying before, you're gonna be a star, bro. We're curing cancer. We're gonna do it, and you're gonna be so famous for it, bro. This arm won't Anyway, yeah, I just want to call to let you know that you're on the brink of curing it, man, and we're going to do it, okay? Yes, I know I am pretty big deal. Yes, I am out for hike, getting ready. Yes, I will call you back. Bye-bye. Uh, Go baby, run, run, go baby, we are breaking high score in nature, go baby. You deprive these cell phone towers, and you ruin the world. The price of freedom's high. It always has been. But it's a price I'm willing to pay. And if I'm the only one, so be it. But I'm willing to bet I'm not.
I won't be able to defeat School Man on my own. I'm strong, but he's always been stronger. I need to build a team. Not a team like a soccer team, like a team like the Justice League. <laughs> It's Scuba Matt, Mom. He's really, really powerful. He's really good at melee combat, on land or in the water. And he's, he's just a beast that needs to be stopped. Sam, I'm not training you again. Remember that time in second grade when you attacked Sean? What? That was literally nothing. I just pushed him. You bit off his fingers. You guys, you guys don't understand the situation. Look at my face. This is what Scuba Matt is going to make all of America look like. You guys must hate America or something. Sam, just stick with running your lemonade stand. Give up all this hero stuff. Fine. Customers. Lemonade for sale. There's so much evil in this world that needs to be taken care of. It's such a waste of time. I should. School Matt is about to nuke the water tower. What? That's terrible. Yeah, I know. No one else knows. No one else understands how big of a deal this is, and how big, how much Mile City is at risk right now. I need, I need you to get my team. This is bad. Okay, Henry. Hey, wait! My bike is gone! There's so much evil in this world, I can't take it anymore. Homeless people have homes. Well, I'm eating dinner right now. Join me if you want. Uh, do you have any chocolate milk? Ah, it's warm. 
Let's pretend it's hot chocolate. It's pulp. Where are you? I turned around to look at this squirrel for two minutes. And I turn around and you disappear into thin air. Sorry, babe. Duty called. I'm on the track of a litterer. And by the size of the footprint, definitely a communist. Okay, okay, okay. Quickly defeat the communist and then go home and drink some soup to heal your wounds. Don't worry, my sweet sugar blossom. I'm a quick worker the pinko. Awesome star, Hula Mastila, Hula Baskila, Toy! Together. But what if we can't beat him? We'll do that together too. Plus, I'll get you a cookie from Subway. Okay. I'm in. What do you want? I'm building a team. No, I got this. Is that a crossbow? Whoa there. That was close. We refrained from showing you that insane violence in order to keep this video family friendly. Anyways, let's see what happens next. What you did back there was really awesome. I know. Still got it. Oh my goodness. Last time I saw you was in South Africa hunting rhinoceroses with a bow and arrow. Last time I saw you was at a lemonade stand this morning. <laughs> what? That, that wasn't, that couldn't have been me. No, you must, you have the wrong guy. Oh, okay, whatever. Um, what happened to your face? Well, that's what I'm here to talk to you about. 
It's him. I know exactly who you mean. I have a certain set of abilities I can attribute to your team. I'm in. These animals may look like boring lumps, but sea cucumbers have all sorts of surprises. This hairy sea cucumber takes several hours to burrow under the sand. Its body now safely hidden. It's time to eat. Show me your true potential. Good job, you made the team. Let's get to work. Do you want to know? What they taught me in the scouts? Yes. They taught me time management. Teamwork. Not tying. Adaptability. Wait. Did they teach you how to sell popcorn? I was the best. Cooking. An importance of physical fitness. There was a wide range of opportunities in scouting. From hiking to whitewater rafting, everything involved some aspect of physical fitness and first aid. They made you into a weapon. I didn't ask for this much power. They bought me the different types of firewood. They showed me how to light it and keep it lit. These are fun and exciting things to know, but knowledge. It always comes at a cost. You poor boy. What have they done to you? All scout leaders must live by 12 principles. They must be friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. But I am not clean. I have not showered in four days. I'm breaking code and I fear for my life. Here, I have something that'll cheer you up. A Lunchable? No, a pizza Lunchable. Take it. Yes.
Give me don't dip back in, come on dip. Can you speak English? Boogie beep, okay, dip, bop, 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 dip, bop, 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 bop. Do you have a seven? No, go there. Who give up a turn? 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 You won't let me get my card. Come on, Java here. Boogie never blew. Oh, do you have a four? No. Dude, you're terrible at guessing. So, can I grab a card now? Can I get a card? You know, I think I'll just grab it. Ha <laughs> ha! You didn't have to go full force on him like that, man. Actually, I, I think I'm pretty good to go. I feel like a, I feel like a sea cucumber right now. Wait, what do you mean a sea cucumber? Does she know that I'm saving the world from pollution? Like, I don't know if she realizes what I'm doing for this world. No, but I'll tell her tonight. I think it'll make her like you more. All right, babe, sounds good. Hey, listen, I gotta go. Someone's, uh, someone's littering. Okay, good luck, sugar bear. I'll call you back, okay? All right, love you, bye. Holy guacamole that was close. To keep a PG rating we have decided to show you some puppies really quick. Let's take a break from this violence shall we? myself a deer. Stop 
fini. Who are you? <gasps> Penguins? You're not a penguin. You're not an emperor penguin either. Scuba mat. What's next, coach, sir? He'll know what to do. If he plays his cards right, he'll be able to give himself CPR. It's not working. Just wait. Any second now. Any second. I think he is deceased. Okay, yeah, you're right. Next, next drill, let's go. Now we're gonna catch a bullet with our teeth. Whoa! All right, this drill's pretty straightforward. I'm just gonna shoot this gun and you're gonna catch it with your teeth. Okay, ready? Three. Turn me up, two. turn me up. <laughs> what happened? Well, he didn't believe. The number one rule is obviously respect. And the number two rule is kill scuba Matt. But the number three rule is believe. So. Okay. So anyways. What do I do next, coach? Let's go get a hot dog or something. All right.
resilient. What's wrong, honey? You seem down. Some days, I wonder if I should even be a superhero. It's all right, little cup. You know superheroes aren't real. Real people can't be superheroes. You know that, right? It's, it's my life. It's all I know how to do. Too many lives are at stake. I can't give up being a hero. You know, Sam, sometimes you've got to give up the things that you love. Oh, he's just a kid off the street. I help. It helps me on an stand. He's adopted. I was right. Think of all the good things you could do. Hang up the wet suit. Juice some lemons. My stomach hurts. How's your lemonade stand, Sam? There you are. Why weren't you at morning training? Only half my team showed up. <laughs> if I got a story to tell you. I was hiking into town this morning and all of a sudden I was attacked. Do you want to ask me how I survived? Well, I think my problems are a little bigger. But... Well, I'm going to tell you anyway. I was hiking into town this morning, and I was attacked by a puma. And while I was laying there, it was chewing on my shoulder, and I recalled the scout's code. The code states that I will do my duty to God and country, help all people, obey the scout law, remain physically fit, mentally strong, and morally straight. And that's when I knew I had to kill the puma. So you're trying to tell me that you killed a puma with your bare hands. Once my fingers touched that puma's carotid artery, even it knew it was dead. This is the badge I got for killing it. There's a, there a lot of blood. It, like, a lot, a lot of blood. It was very, very bloody. guys cardio or calisthenics back because we're carrying the weight of mouse city on our shoulders all these lives we're putting them in the backpack the backpack of justice justice that's my middle name and my last name is liberty and my first name is freedom all right, my name is Harold you can call me Harry if you want all right, so, anyways, um, you guys are all way too advanced for training. I think we can all agree on that. I've seen your potential, what you can do in the field. Everything is just off the charts. So we're just going to get straight to the mission. Have you heard what's going on outside the town in the woods? People are going missing every day. Wait, this is textbook scuba mat. I literally read a book one time about how to defeat scuba mat, and this was in it. Guys, I really think this is our chance to get back at him for everything that he's taken from us and all that we've lost. But Scuba Matt didn't take anything from me. What did he take from you? Well, uh, he killed my parents. Um, and uh, see that house over there? That's my new one because he blew up my last one. And uh, my dog ran away and I never saw it again. He had to have killed that. I don't have, I don't have a cat or a fish. But a cat, he would definitely throw that off the roof. And the fish, he would drown. 100%. Then, if I had a working toilet, he would clog that thing. It would be bad. And even, 
Get this, one day, I was doing the dishes, came over and helped me do my dishes. We understand. We will help you end Scuba Matt's reign of terror. For America! For, For America! Why does Sam think that you are going to nuke the water tower? OMG Scuba Matt you are such a crackhead. I literally cannot take you anywhere. Sorry guys, I thought it was scuba mat. Let's keep moving. Yeah guys, this is definitely something scuba mat would do. Probably killing all these people and eating them or something. He's just a just an evil guy, you know. One time, oh another thing, one time. He's helped my grandma. 90 year old grandma Debbie, get this, cross the street, and I hate her. Scuba Matt? That was so horrible. I just, I just couldn't believe it. But I mean, I think we're on to him now. I think we got him. Wait, stop. What about our other team? That one other guy that was on our team? He's really tall, really big, always lifting weights. Uh, had really long hair. Um, that, that doesn't ring a bell. Uh, don't worry, it's probably just nap time. What? Uh, uh, what? Yeah, what are you talking about? Wasn't our other teammate, that little short kid, the one who was helping you with the lemonade stand yesterday? What? He's like, Henry's like six. We don't want him to see us murder someone. Wait, we're murdering people? I thought we were just like putting handcuffs on him and taking him to jail. No, murder's the only way we can get scuba mat. Headshots and decapitations only. Is that clear? That's how I roll. Ah! Dang it! Ah! Ah! That was scuba mat! I, ro I really ah! thought that was scuba mat. Dude, you sound just like him. Ah! Ah! Dang, bro. I'm really sorry. Ah! Hey, you want to come look at this wound? See what you think about it. Yeah, he's gonna die. That's fantastic shot placement, though. If that was a bad guy, thank you. If that was a bad guy, then I'd be very impressed. But uh, 
This is our teammate. Ah. 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 Right. Okay. I'm going to die. Put it down. Put it down. Ah. Ah. Scuba Bat is going to hear your screaming. Just because you died doesn't mean we have to go down with you. All right, let's keep moving. We got a mighty convoy rocking through the night. We got a mighty convoy and she's beautiful sight. Oh, we got a convoy, convoy, to the convoy. Oh, way down south in the land of traitors, rattlesnakes and alligators come away. Come away. Dixieland. Where cotton's king? Something about farming. Farming, farming, farming on a plantation farm. Come away. To the farm. Dixieland. Scott, 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 Scott's a great, I like to white water raft. Oh, Scott, 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 Scott's a Scott, great, I'm a master of my craft. I hike all day and I eat pine cones for breakfast. Whoa, oh my goodness, you gave yourself CPR. I'm earning my Subway cookie. All right, we're ready to get scuba mat. Oh, it's got, 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 these are pros that are doing this. And use pro weapons and pro methods. All right guys, we'll make camp here for the night. You guys stay right here on this log. Just do normal superhero stuff. I'm gonna go set up a perimeter. And so when Scuba Matt comes to ambush you, I'll ambush him. Awesome plan. What happens if he gets past you and kills us? No. Hey, I'm way stronger than him. He won't, he won't get past me. But what if he does? Okay, okay, fine. I'll, I'll give you these walkie talkie. If he comes and just call me or something, I'll come save you. I wonder what it's like to get my head chopped off. Hmm. So what great superhero deeds have you done, fellow superhero? Well, one time I let a rat build a nest in my hair and it had beautiful rat babies. But then I ate them because I thought they were chicken wings. You must be homeless. I've met your kind before. Three years ago, during my Eagle Scout project, I built a house for this smelly homeless dude. He looked just like you, but three years younger. Stupid idiot burned the house down first day. Built a campfire in the living room. So, do you pollute often or just sometimes? I'm gonna take that as a yes. Hello, hello, is anybody there? Copy. No batteries. Barbecue, huh? How do you like your ribs? 
That's homeless blood. Yams. Three grams of dietary fiber? It's too much. Ah, uh, I suppose you're here to kill me for littering. Well, I have a confession to make. I litter. A lot. It's just my way of rebelling to the scouts. I never wanted to be in the scouts. I was put in at a young age. They made me into a walking weapon. They took my childhood away from me. I didn't want any of that. So if you're here to do it, just do it. about the stupid water tower. I don't think you understand. If he nukes the water tower, then there'll be no water for the forest. So, basically, you're saving the whole world by doing this. No, we're saving the whole world. gave me the extra lumber from the last job we did so I thought that's such a tragic thing that happened to the lemonade stand and we can rebuild because life's kind of like renewal and I figure we could probably get two stands a running and that would be just a, a real darn good thing and you know one time there was this pig that got loose and you know Sam that's what happened to the pigs and it was because of the lemonade and it was a good thing and you know your uncle Cecil's coming this weekend and he's a really good carpenter and he'll be able to help you with all that extra building that we're going to be doing. Yeah, that's cool, but there's just so much evil in the world and I'm, I'm just too powerful to ignore it. Okay, I, I have to go. All right, well I'll get the, sharp, the saws all sharpened up.
yourself. Why did you pick me for your team? You had all those other members and they're all pretty good. Why did you pick me over them? Well, the big, to me, the bigger difference, the biggest difference that I see is they're dead and you're alive. So I don't know about you, but a alive person seems more useful than a dead person. You know? But also, you are pretty much. One, it's just my whole life all I ever want to do is, is just protect the forest and people just keep littering. I, I'm, I'm not trying to kill them, you know, I'm beating them up and I guess I'm too powerful or something. Every single time I accidentally kill one or someone. So. That's crazy because I've, I've had that same problem all the time. Like a team I made, most of them I wasn't even trying to kill. They just died. Like that guy with the hard shot? That was me. That was you? That was me. Dude, that was some incredible shot placement. I know, I just can't help it. I'm just too powerful, I guess. If only it would have been screw a mat. Just would have been so nice. Just a quick hard shot would have ended him. It looked really cool too. Um, so how are we even gonna protect the water tower from a nuclear weapon? Well that's easy. We just set up a night shift. So there's constant surveillance on the water tower. Nothing will get past us. Sam, if we're gonna take down somebody this big, then we're gonna need a superhero lair. Well, I know just the place. stuff. Flowers. We got puppies. Flowers. This man is so evil. Okay, we got over there. More guns. This is my lemonade stand. Obviously very important. More s pictures of school of stupid face up there. So this is, this is him nuking the yeah, water Exactly. Tower. The nuke. This is obviously the water tower. Nuke. Boom. Devastation. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Over here is some more very important stuff. Hey, get over here. Oh. All right, I need to show you what all these are for because they're all very important if we're gonna kill Scuba Matt. This is for, this is for measuring or, okay, I don't know. Um, this is a hammer. Could be obviously very lethal. This is a fire extinguisher. This is something we would not use if he was lit on fire. But we could use it for if we got the chance. Uh, we could use it to smash his skull in, you know? That would be useful. It's for making sandwiches if we get hungry. Now this is very lethal. Like, take one of these to the eye socket. You're not coming back, but that ends you right there. This is for starting him on fire. This is made out of silver, just in case he's a, a vampire. You never know. Yep. Um, you can just stab. Oh, this is for training. I don't know why this is there. This is for like maybe shooting deer or something. This is this could be rigged up as an explosive. Put put it in his back pocket. Boom! Flyers ripping out his hair. This is waterproof. Underwater fights pretty good. These are for. Oh, you just make it up, I don't know. <laughs> These are for, well, there's a lot of things you can do this for. You could like rip things, um, like 
Like if you were, like you, if you needed to like. Okay. Um, okay. So there's this hammer. You could throw that. It'd be really good. Kind of like. I don't know. This is for when we get them tied up and we just. Right into tempo. This is for making sure it's level. He's level for when we use this. So all the calculations line up. Same, same, same. But. I actually don't know how to use this one, so. Alright, what were you gonna say? Sam, these are literally horrible, horrible ways to kill people. Some of them are kind of cool, right? What was this for? What was this for, Sam? Well, you see, that was to my toilet, but the screw in that broke it. So, we don't need to talk about that. So, like, what did he even do to you, Sam? What did he do to make you want to do this to him? Well, you see, honestly, it all happened when I was four years old, playing on the beach. Obviously, I would assume that you're intelligent enough to realize that we obviously need to end Scuba Matt. Dear God, that is an incredibly tragic story. So like, what's the first thing we can do to strike against Scuba Matt? Well, the first thing we can do is make sandwiches. The second thing, is set up a night shift. Contact me if you need any backup. Any questions about the night, night shift? Yeah, actually, um, if I'm doing the night shift, why am I here during the day? Well, you'll watch the water tower from now until night, and then until the next morning, and then the morning after that. Maybe even the morning after that. That's it's kind of a really long time. Well, it's very necessary to keep the water tower safe. We must protect it at all costs. If you had to sit here for a month straight, then so be it. Well, okay, what are you gonna be doing? It's music night with my family. Music night? What, 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 
what 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 Civilians is a joke. You must, because you're not here, and you not being here has put millions of lives at risk. So, what's the what's the deal? Over. Sam, I I, I literally got beat up by like a Sasquatch dude. You you can't get mad at me for that. You weren't even there. I tried to contact you with the walkie-talkie, and you didn't put any batteries in it. Okay, yeah, I guess that was my bad. From now on, I'll have Henry watch the water tower. Over. You know what, Sam? We need a new game plan, okay? I'm, I'm sick of waiting for Squamat to just attack us whenever he wants to, okay? I've got an idea, but I'll have to meet up at the super awesome superhero lair thing. So I just, just meet me there, okay? Okay, sounds good. Over. Okay, Henry. Watch out for planes or submarines. Those are the most likely ways that the scuba mount will nuke the water tower. A garden country, I will defend this water tower. Okay, good. kidnap her to get to you and if he gets to you then he'll probably get to me and that cannot happen okay so you need to you need to focus up here Sam she's literally just stop made... listen to me my mom says sometimes you gotta give up the things you love to do what you need to do Sam chill literally okay I have a date with her tomorrow night so tonight we're free and we're gonna go have dinner with, with Scuba Matt tonight. All right, I'm sorry. I thought you just said have dinner with Scuba Matt. I don't know if we're talking about the same Scuba Matt here, but I'm thinking of 
the most powerful being in the universe. The school mat, the destroyer of water towers. He literally could be the dragon warrior. If you think this is some amateur organization that will deal with terrorists, then you're wrong. We do not negotiate with terrorists! Or right, what would be so bad about that, Sam? Hey, maybe we can catch him off guard if we negotiate with him. Then, then we kill him? Head, only headshots and decapitations. Maybe we can talk him out of it, you know? Like, just be nice and... Unless he litters, then okay. we'll kill him. Yeah, then we'll kill him. If he litters. Then we'll kill him. Alright. Um, babe, we're gonna go have dinner with School and Matt. I'm really sorry. Tomorrow we'll have a really awesome date. So... Alright, my sweet sugar blossom. All right, Sam, we got a fancy dinner to get to. Let's get pimped out. Grace, could we, could we get a ride? Sure. We needed a, a neutral spot to meet Scuba Matt. But what, what if he what if he blows it up again, or kills my parents again, or breaks my toilet again, or kills my fish again, or? <laughs> this is such a bad idea. I can't do this. No, it's Scuba. It's it's Scuba.
I just thought of the best plan to defeat Scooby Man. Sam, I can't do this anymore, man. My hand hurts, and I just want to go home. No. You don't get it. I'm like, have you ever seen Shrek? I'm like Shrek, and you're like Donkey. You need me. We have a destiny to fulfill. I, I'm sick of all this stupid, like, liberty and justice. I'm not justice, Sam, neither are you. No, I am justice. Don't you get it? You are nothing without me. Without me, you'd just be wandering around your stupid forest, killing people for no reason because they litter. You know, I'm like Batman and you're like Robin. You, you are just a little boy with no pants and a tiny yellow cape. My, my costume was epic. You, you can't even give me that. <laughs> It was cool. I thought it was just a Hawaiian shirt. I thought that was it, man. I'm off the team, Sam. I'm done. Okay, fine. I need you to do something, though. Go over to the sink and turn on the faucet. What happens? Water comes out, doesn't it? What do you think will happen if Scuba Matt nukes the water tower? What? Not not water come out. That's all I know. So, either you join the team, or the world starves. You know what, Sam? The world sucks anyways. They're, they're just a bunch of litterers. <gasps> no, what? No one hangs up on me. <sighs> I am justice. Never get away with this. Scuba Matt! Scuba Matt! Shrek. Shrek, is that you, Shrek? So, um, how you been? Okay. Um, <clears throat> I know we don't, I know we don't talk very much anymore. Brothers, not how it should be, but it's the way it is, I guess. Just wanted to let you know that I left the team. I, I left the team.
You want me to go to Alaska? I mean, I, I would say that was a good talk, but we didn't really talk. So, I guess see you around, bro, bro Chacho. by your past? Yes. One time three weeks ago, they put spicy chicken on my salad instead of regular chicken. It was devastating. Oh, babe, I gotta get going. Um, my spider senses are tingling right now. Someone's in danger. What about our bait? 
we can reschedule it, trust me. Millions of people are probably gonna die if I don't do this. Tony, money is awesome, but you're better than money. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Sam, it's me, Tony, um, listen, dude, I'm, I'm sorry about the way that, that things went down between us, but after my hand healed from getting stabbed, my vision was clear, and I knew that I had to go to Alaska, you know, land of the free, home of the brave, last frontier, I mean, I think that, uh, a gold rush took place here. The show Alaska The Last Frontier also takes place here. Um, oh, Ice Road Truckers takes place here. Um, oh, Christopher Nolan movie takes place here. Uh, anyways, um, I think you'll have to do some housekeeping <laughs> while I'm gone because, I mean, Grace, is, she's good at killing litterers, but she uses a knife and she isn't, like, that good at killing people, if you get what I'm saying. So you might have to, like, pitch in, like, use a gun or something just to like, keep the numbers down. So, but other than that, man, um, good luck. Hopefully, I'll be back sometime. Oh, the scouts, the scouts, the scouts are great. I hate scuba, man. The scouts, the scouts, the scouts are great. I will kill a scuba, man. What do you want? Kiss, give me a bop, 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 that man can run faster than a great white shark and jump higher than a saber-toothed tiger. You're in for a world of pain, you stinky monster. Give it on the hiki! You stink! Hey Tony. 
Uh, I don't know if you're gonna get this or not, babe, but somebody littered in the park and it's pretty bad. Um, if you get this, just give me a call back. Okay, bye. What would Tony do? Take that, Tony. Hey Sam, it's me, Tony. Been trying to call you, but you don't pick up your phone anymore. It sucks, I guess. Freaking turd. You need to pick up your phone, dude. Anyways, I don't know. I've, I've grown fond of Alaska, but I don't know. I just I feel like coming home. It's just the water. The, the oceans here aren't deep enough for me. I, I dive to the bottom, and it's like, dude, I'm only at 40% lung capacity. This is easy. You know what I'm saying? You get my get my drift? Anyways, I think that I should come home now, because I broke up with Grace, so that I could have more time to dive really deep. But I've already dove the deepest, so there's, like, no point anymore, and it's freaking stupid. So, I'm coming home. We're going to save the forest. And, uh gonna save the water tower. I just, like I don't have a purpose anymore though. I feel lost. You know, without, I don't have any justice. I don't have a girlfriend. I, I don't know if Sam, ha, ha, have you seen Sam actually? I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, you wouldn't know Sam, never mind. Um, oh, I, actually, speaking of Sam, I. I'm not gonna look for him. You know, maybe, maybe I'll find him. So. All right, I'll leave you to it. Good luck. I'm staring at whatever you're staring at. What? 
Didn't know you were looking for more than I could ever Yeah Rosanna Yeah All I wanna do in the makeup in the morning is see right Rosanna Rosanna Didn't know you were looking for more than I could ever Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hello? Time back. Meet me in the woods in one hour. 17 minutes and 48 seconds, Pacific time, PM. Time for an upgrade. What's this? This is destiny. So what we were up to do to that destroyed all of our defenses. So this right here, this, this is all we have. So I think we owe it to all the people of Mile City to make this camp. This is our last move to justice. Do you think he's actually gonna like come and try to nuke the water tower? I know it's cool, man. He'll be here. Ugh. I kinda like, have you ever just gotten the feeling that somebody's like coming towards you and, and it's like, it's a lot like, um. No, I never get that feeling. So there's some one movie. It's um, it's got a shark in it. <laughs>
Maxwell Treadwell Bimwell the Third Junior. I'm surprised you haven't heard of me. Huh. Well, since you haven't heard of me, I'll tell you my life story, I suppose. Well, I was born at a very young age, and uh, my parents did not show up to my birth. It, it was tragic. Um, something I'd prefer not to remember. But ever since I was born, I've had a very good memory, a photographic memory, in fact. But uh, yes, ever since then, I've been on a path of vengeance, you could say. One could call it a uh, killing spree, actually. From beast to man, I have murdered one of everything, at least. And uh, then one day, I met Scuba Matt, and he adopted me. And he too, just like my parents, neglected me. Except he, uh, he flushed me down the toilet. It was, uh, it was a quite large toilet. Uh, when I woke up in the sewer, all I could think of was killing him. <sighs> Tragic times indeed. Then I checked my phone, and I saw um, a tweet that said, uh, what did it say? Might might uh, nuke the water tower later? I don't I don't know. Something like that. And I just thought um, I need to kill Scuba Matt, and that is my story. Good day, gentlemen. Hey, hey, what? hey, where, where, where are you from? I am from another dimension. I killed Scuba Matt. What? What? But he just said he killed Scuba Matt. Wait, no, I think I did. No way! Are you... are you being for real? Yes, I am for real. Oh, tell the truth. Yeah, she, she's not lying. This... she goes scuba mad! What a turn of events. Should we, should we keep her? No. She's too dangerous. She probably did all this damage, actually. Yeah,
Why are you giving it to me? I'm just gonna have to go over it. Don't make me mad, man. 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 Free time doing hate crimes Pollution ain't the solution So I shot him five times in the face Left him in a big pile of trash bags Yeah Hey. Woo! I killed my whole team It was just an accident A lot of people aren't as smart as me Cause they don't realize That if you nuke a tower a water tower Then the whole town will die So that's why I'm here Yeah Bustin' killer rhymes, doing killer time on the grind And I, I shine all the time and I'm on the water tower grind Saki-maki-laki, mana-hoki-maki-taki Doki-mataki, wa-wa 